A new technology invented here in the Bay Area could soon ease some of the trauma faced by women who undergo surgery for breast cancer. As ABC7 News anchor Cheryl Jennings reports, it's designed to help make cosmetic breast reconstruction easier and less painful. Hi, Chris. How are you doing today? When Chris Kine faced a diagnosis of cancer in her left breast, she made an aggressive choice, a double mastectomy to be followed by breast reconstruction. Plastic surgeon Dr. Kamakshi Zeidler also told Chris about an experimental technology that might speed the timetable. We talked about the reconstruction and implants, and she said, um, introduce the idea to me of the air expanders. This simulates the implanted expander underneath the skin. All patients take home is this remote. The air expander is a temporary implant filled with compressed CO2 gas. It's placed under the skin during the mastectomy. Later, the patient uses a wireless remote control to slowly inflate the device over the course of several weeks. The purpose is to create a stretched out pouch where surgeons will place the permanent breast implants during reconstruction. Dr. Zeidler says it's quicker and less painful than the saline injections traditionally used to expand the skin. Hearing that they're going to be in control of this expansion process to start and stop or go as quickly or as slowly as they want has a huge emotional impact. Um, in addition, not having to come in and be poked with a needle when they're seeing their doctor. We first profiled air expanders several years ago while they were still in development. The company, based in Palo Alto, has now completed enrollment in a multi-year clinical trial. Preliminary data showed women with the air expanders completed expansion in an average of 17 days compared to 52 days with saline injections. So you're able to give a lot more in a short period of time because the dose is made very, very small and comfortable for the patient. Dr. Zeidler says the time frame for the reconstruction surgery still depends on the healing process, which can vary, but that women using the air expanders will have their natural shape back while doctors monitor their progress. Looking good in clothes, women can wear bathing suits with expanders and go about their regular lives. Chris completed breast reconstruction surgery after participating in the air expander trial and believes the double mastectomy was the right decision for her. Because I'm 65 years old and I had places to go and things to do and the rest of my life to live. Cheryl Jennings, ABC 7 News. The company is now in the process of reviewing the final data from the study and plans to present it to the FDA for approval.